In this video, I have brought you the solution of suit and hat better with explanation and examples. Hi, I'm Sanjeev and you all are welcome to my channel. First, what is the similarity between suit and hat better? Well, both suit and hat better are used for advice, for a suggestion, but they are also different. So how they are different? Let's begin with sud. Sud is used for advice or suggestion. When we see the meaning of sud, the meaning of sud is like if something is good to do, then in such case we use sud. So sud means it is a good thing to do. With sud, we always use the root form of verb or verb one. For instance, you should listen to your teacher carefully. Why you should listen to your teacher carefully? Because listening to the teacher is a good idea. It's a good thing to do. As we listen to the teacher carefully, then we understand what the teacher is saying, which contributes to our knowledge. Therefore, listening to the teacher in the classroom is a good thing to do. Therefore, we use, we should, or you should listen to your teacher carefully. On the other hand, what about had better? Had better is used for a strong advice or suggestion with a warning. The important thing for you to notice here is with had better, we offer a kind of warning, a kind of negative consequence. Or let's say had better is used to suggest that if you don't follow the warning, something bad will happen. Take example with a structure. With had better also, you use verb one. And example is, you had better study well or you will fail in the exam. So there is an, there is an advice. The advice is study well. But along with that advice, what if one does not study well? Then there is, is a kind of warning. There is a kind of bad consequence. The bad consequence is or you will fail in the exam. As this example includes the bad consequence, therefore we are using you had better study well or you will fail in the exam. Before showing you the solution, let me tell you that you can visit my website sanjeepnirola.com of which link I'll be giving in the description uh, from which you can get all the notes related to grammar. Uh, not only grammar, you can also click the literature section and get the notes of uh, literary text uh, including summary as well as important question and answers. Now, time for the questions from Grade 11 English. So, let's begin what the question says. Question, instruction. Complete the sentences with should or should not. Use one of these verbs. So, here you have drink, visit, leave, roam, and quit in brackets. So, you depending on the questions, you should say should drink or should not drink, should visit or should not visit, should leave or should not leave, should roam or should not roam, and should quit or should not quit. Enjoy it.
Now, second question says, put in hat better or suit. Important thing for you to uh, take care of in this very exercise is, if it is just an advice, suggesting that it is a good thing to do or it's a bad thing to do, then you go for should or should not. If there is a warning or if it shows possible bad consequence, in such case, go with had better. Enjoy. It brings us to the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed watching it. Keep watching and keep loving.